What is going on, everybody? As I said in the previous video, we we're going to talk about grading, and I have something that kind of shocked me. And I'm going to get into that here into the video. It'll probably be a couple minutes, and you know, I get a little winded on some of this stuff. But this is provided by gemrate.com. This shows, you know, how much cards are being graded. Um, these just show the stats, uh, items graded yesterday, which was December 30th. Now, of course, when you look at this, this is the holiday season, so things are going to be a little bit slower. It always is from Thanksgiving through New Year's. PSA's down, SGC's down, CGC stayed the same, Beckett went up. Everybody wants to know, why did Beckett go up? Is Beckett getting crazy again? No, they got like a sell. I think it's like 23% off grading. And what I've heard, I have not seen or know anybody on to this, I should say, is that a lot of people are saying the Becca grades are very, very horrible. And with that, they've come back and cracked those out and sent them to other services. Not to name like it's, they sent the PSA, SGC, or CDC, and they got better grades. The other thing I've heard is that some of the cards have been damaged. I, I don't know. I've heard people saying that it was the bottom right corner. I, I have no idea on that again. It could be. Maybe you just have somebody who doesn't know how to, you know, pull cards out, put them in. I have no idea. But, yes, Beckett did have their numbers go up. All right. You guys ready for the shocking news I was talking about? So, yeah, um, it was Friday. Had an order pop PSA. It got done around 2 in the Easter time. They gave me track, and I'm like, oh, cool. This is going to send out because the vault stuff sent out for me. Well, it didn't go out. So Saturday, I get an alert in my phone. It says, hey, this is scheduled for delivery. It was said Thursday. Now it's Tuesday, of course. It, it shipped out FedEx. I was a shock. I'm like, dang, PSA ship it out on a Saturday? Never heard of them doing it from California. Lo and behold, I go to look. It's coming from New Jersey. I knew the New Jersey office was doing a lot of the like TCG slash Pokemon Magic the Gathering cards. I ship my stuff to California. And I should pull, let me pull up the dates onto this real quick. Um, I don't know where this is going to come up at. Let me pull that over. Ooh, I don't know. I, I don't want to pull something up and it has somebody's name on because my PSA submissions. I would say these have been a PSA. I set up my last show was, I want to say, December. So we sent this off after the November show. So probably like mid-November the order. It's already back, which is really good. Don't get me wrong. Because now when you go into PSA's website, they have an estimated no later date on there. And I think it was like 1 March or something. But it shocked me to see that it's coming out of New Jersey. So somehow my cards went to California. They must have took them, sent them up to New Jersey. I made the joke. and I'm like, well, I was wondering why there were all these tens in this order. But granted, I will tell you guys now, a little spoiler. I still cannot get a Chet Holmgren Auto PSA 10 for my life. I don't know. It's just something about that guy. And me grading this year. I think I'm done grading Chets. But other than that, it was a very, very good order. You guys will get to see that uh, sometime coming up this week. It should be in Tuesday, so look at a later video onto it. And another spoiler alert. I am sorry, Wildcat. It's all basketball. Ah, one, one hockey. I take it back. One hockey. But it, it was different because now... I even went back in and looked at PSA's website because I was like, am I shipping stuff to New Jersey? I'm not. So I don't know if they're getting stuff in. They're like, okay, hey, send, you know, half of this stuff up there or how they're doing it. It would be quite interesting to actually hear from somebody, one of the hierarchy in PSA on how that's being done. Um, you know, how much is being set up in there and stuff like that. I, I didn't know they were doing sports cards already in out of New Jersey. This is the first. So if you guys haven't paid attention and looked at any of your trackings and stuff, I can tell you, I went back and looked at my other trackings from uh, this past month in November, and they all came from California. 
So th this is my first one. It's come out of New Jersey. So I'm thinking we're going to start seeing some turnaround times a lot quicker on some of this stuff. I don't know if the thing is that, you know, hey, they're going to start sending a lot of the bulk stuff up to New Jersey and all the other stuff, you know, stay down there and they keep only a percentage of bulk. I have no idea. Like I said, until PSA says something about it, I, I, I can only guess at it. All right, let's go back into... I don't know if they put out the numbers yet this month. No. This is just something the other stuff to look at. If you look, they break it down by sports. And this is through everybody across the bat. A lot of people great in baseball. Then basketball, because we just started. Makes sense. Football, people trying to get those last minute ones in for Super Bowl. But it, it's just really different to see like golf is way at the bottom. Uh, there was something else here. Those are that. Oh, that might have been it. I was hoping that it might have had something like a weekly or their overall monthly already showing it does. And I've been on here for a while, but I wanted to just take a look because I was curious after I seen my shipment coming from New Jersey and being great out of New Jersey, what PSA's new numbers were. I knew it would be a little bit affected because of the holidays. We're going to start taking a look more into depth. Uh, I would probably say middle to end of January. Just see if their numbers are going up and start seeing those turnaround times being a lot quicker. As always, if you guys have seen other shipments coming from New Jersey or sports cards, let me know in the comments because I, I was kind of shocked by it. Maybe they're saying, hey, you know, if your cards are from these states, when it comes into California, we're pushing it to New Jersey. I don't know. That could be another, you know, myth out there that's going around that, hey, if you live in these areas, once PSA gets it in, they're pushing it up there. I would think that they would already uh, have you send them there to alleviate their expenses on shipping because they're going to have to freight those up there and insure them the whole way up. Kind of crazy still. All right, guys, that is it for me. I'm trying to think here. I, I wish I would have been able to go back and pull my tracker. I'll have to do it from another one because, like I said, I didn't want to pull people's information up. I thought about doing it here real quick. If my luck, it would show up on a screen. But I'm kind of curious from the day I mailed it to the day it got logged into PSA. I think it was relatively the normal. But I think from it being logged in to it being research and ID took a while. If that, that has to be where it's set, got sent up to New Jersey is my thought process, though. I know somebody's going to ask that in the comments. All right, guys. I appreciate it as always. I will see you guys next video.